Hello everyone, welcome to the vlog. Today I have a very exciting vlog because I am officially doing my senior show. If you guys don't know, I am a senior this year at RISD, which is Rhode Island School of Design. I'm an illustration major and all the illustration majors have an opportunity to do a senior show. I want to preface with a couple of things. First of all, before anyone asks, this dress is from Lazy Oaf. Second of all, I titled this video My Senior Show, but it is actually a group of very talented artists that I'm with in this senior show so it's not like 100% mine, but I'm gonna be showing you guys my portion of the senior show, which is why I titled it My Senior Show. I'm very excited to be showing you guys what I've been working on the past two days because I was gonna vlog the whole process, but honestly, it was getting to be a lot. So I just wanted to come and show you guys the final process. I posted a little bit ago on my Instagram. If you're not following it, you definitely should. I posted an invite for anyone who was a RISD student to come and see my senior show on opening night, which was last night. And I'm here to recap it for you guys because it was so so much fun and I really really loved it and I just want to share the experience with you guys and I want to also take you through the gallery if you don't have an opportunity to come if you're either not a RISD student or you're not in this country or you just don't have a chance to come because I know a lot of people were telling me god I wish I could come but I'm simply not there, which is totally understandable. So I have so many friends on the internet that I wanna share with you guys my experience and everything. And it's been really, really fun. I've actually been really, really busy this weekend because I've been working on my senior show. I had a bunch of little like trinket stuff to bring to, because as you guys know, a lot of my work is 3D. So we have a bunch of that stuff there. And I also went and printed out a bunch of my stuff on the new plotters. They're not new, but they're new to me. I never actually used the plotters at my school before but it made the prettiest prettiest prints so when we go and look at it it's gonna be so beautiful because the print quality is so good I've never had pinks turn out so pretty you guys know almost all of my work is pink so that was very very exciting to do overall it was a really really fun process I actually spent a lot more time on it than I thought I was going to because I feel like I was just gonna kind of wing it and like see what would happen but then as I was doing stuff the more and more work I was getting done the more I wanted to put more effort into it it ended up being really really good in my opinion i really like how it came out and last night was the opening night and it was so much fun because so many viewers came out and said hello and i love meeting you guys oh my god this is my last semester at RISD, and so i'm really sad that i won't be able to meet everyone here that probably wanted to meet me and of course i want to meet you guys too so just to preface if you guys ever see me out and about on the streets feel free to say hi and i had such a great time meeting all of you we took some selfies i saw some of your work it was really really fun yeah, it was a great experience. I'm so happy that I did it because honestly, I was really stressed about it for the longest time because I have so much work to do right now. Oh my God. Getting the senior show done was honestly a major accomplishment for me and I am very, very happy about it. Let's just go ahead and head over and I'm gonna show you guys everything in the senior show because I put a lot of effort into it. I think it looks really, really nice. I took up the whole middle of the gallery, so it's very pretty. So let's just go ahead and head over and see what I put in my senior show. Woo! Alrighty everyone, so welcome to my virtual tour of my gallery or our gallery. First thing I have here is my whale shark prints that I printed out and they look so pretty. These are the prettiest pinks I've ever seen because I printed them out on the nice plotter machines and hammering these nails in took literally forever. I also have my socials and everything linked, but like hammering this took so long that I got through so many episodes of Crayon Shin Chan, which you can only watch on the Japanese VPN, which brings us to today's sponsor actually, Surfshark VPN. And woo! And that brings us to the sponsor of today's video. This video is sponsored by Surfshark VPN. If you guys don't know what a VPN is, it is a virtual private network, which basically means that it'll just keep you safe online and mask everything that you do. With a VPN, you can basically travel without leaving your home because as you guys know, a lot of things are geographically based online. And sometimes you have to literally physically be there to access these special things in different countries. But with a VPN, you can connect to popular websites, unblock certain streaming platforms that are not available in your country, and change your virtual location which is all so so helpful and Surfshark keeps me safe online so I'm super appreciative of that. If you head over to surfshark.deals forward slash Tiffany Wang and use the code Tiffany Wang you can get up to 83% off and three extra months free. I have honestly I feel like gotten through every single show that I want to watch on every single platform because I'd be doing so much work especially while preparing for the senior show. So now I have access to all of Japan's Netflix and I can watch every single show there until I run out. I really love Crayon Shin Chan. I've been watching it a lot and I will continue to watch it with the Surfshark VPN. So if you guys want to check that show out and many, many more and just be safe online in general, use the Surfshark VPN. I will have it linked down below for you guys. So please use my link 
and search up Korean Shin Chan on Netflix because it is so cute once you get the Japan VPN. But yes, going back to the gallery tour, this is what the whole thing looks like. We got our whale shark babies and I am so proud of how these printed because literally, ugh, I should have been using the plotter so long ago. These I made about advocation for whale sharks because they are currently endangered if you guys didn't know. I made them my junior year, I think. And I also have my socials on every single panel for my gallery so that I don't have anyone confused about who made this stuff, even though I think my aesthetic is pretty clear. And then moving on from the giant wall, which actually has more stuff on the back I'll show in a second, is this table. This is my first podium and it has just some of my little stuff that's not pink because I kind of color coordinated everything. And as you can see, the first thing I have is the whale shark book, which I made, which I actually don't like. And I'm going to be probably remaking this in the next video because I'm trying to clean up my portfolio right now. This has all the prints that I showed on the wall in a book format if you guys wanted to see that. Also, everyone in this gallery is free to touch my stuff as long as you're gentle with it, please. But moving on, we have the stationery set, which I just made a video about. And so this is all using handmade paper and everything, and I think it came out super pretty. So I want to display it because it's one of my most recent works and I'm very proud of it. And so I really love how it looks. I have some of the components like laid out for everyone if they wanted to see the different parts. So there's that. And then we move on to some little trinket dishes that I have for a little bird project that I made about backyard bird endangerment. And I have my baby heart monitors, which I've been working on recently on this channel as well. I just did the packaging. And since I have all this stuff on me on hand, I just decided to put everything I have in the show on honestly. Also, things have been getting disheveled, obviously, because people are coming in and touching stuff, which is totally fine, but this is not my, like, ideal setup. I've had it prettier before. And then here are my backyard birdies. These are made for a blind box set that I made, and they are basically advocating for either endangerment of birds or overpopulation of birds, which are both an issue in suburban America and just America in general, and I got these apple slices. They are very pretty. And I actually made these my sophomore year, which was so, so long ago, but I still love how they came out. I pulled them out of the boxes today to like put them in the gallery and I was like oh my god these are beautiful I did a good job so <laughs> there are those moving on to the last podium that I have which is the pink podium woo it has everything that I made that was pink of course having a pink podium is crucial to a Tiffany Wang gallery setup so I have my protectors of the star galaxy here this is a little doll dress up book that I made that I want to turn into stickers but I've yet to get a chance and we have two of those I have one that has like stuff cut out in it and another one that isn't and then we also have my anatomy babies of course and I've scattered some stickers along here and I actually have a tiny little sheet on my podium that says that my Etsy is open for pre-orders so if anyone at the gallery or any of you guys want to check out my stickers on Etsy you can for pre-order they will be shipped out in about two weeks yeah I want to give everyone the opportunity to have a piece of my art then we have my dollhouse which is the my little bunny dollhouse you guys have seen this a couple of times this was so hard to make but I got it to work and we got the little books as well of course and of course my socials are also on this podium I want to make sure they were on every podium because I printed them on such pretty pretty paper I want everyone to see. This is the back of the giant panel, so I just have some random stuff here. Um, it's not as coordinated as the front, but it still has some pieces that I really, really liked. I wanted to print out the protectors of the Star Galaxy sheets because I do realize that when things are in a book form, not everyone has the patience or effort level to open it up and look inside, so I wanted to print them out just for everyone to see. I also have this one, which is the Grocery Adventures, and this was really cute. I never actually finished this book, but I love the title and the cover, so I wanted to show it. And so here's one last look at pretty much everything. We have the whale sharks, of course, and then we have the podium with all of my little trinket stuff. And I love how all of these came out and just how color coordinated my art was specifically. I wasn't really expecting it, but when I was putting everything on the podium, I was like, oh my God, it's so perfect. And then of course we have the pink section as well. This is very crucial. So I had such a great time setting up this gallery and unfortunately I'm gonna have to take it down soon. So this was really fun. I'm glad I got the document it for you guys. So. Of course, if any of you are new, by the way, and don't know my socials, here they are again, but yeah, that's how my gallery went, and I think it went super amazing, and I'm so happy with it. And so that is the conclusion of my senior show. It honestly went so, so well, and I am so thankful, especially for everyone who showed up to the grand opening, because honestly, I was really nervous that like no one was gonna come, and it was gonna be really awkward and silent, but I had so much fun meeting everyone, and all my classmates that came too, super appreciative of that as well. It was just overall such a great experience, and I honestly didn't think that I would have had so much fun doing a gallery, because honestly, I haven't been in a gallery since high school and I feel like I got and I feel like I got really burnt out in high school from doing galleries because by senior year, I was doing them like every month or two because it was like senior year, you know, and you're doing all the competitions. So 
I had so much fun. I loved everything and I'm going to be using these printouts so I will not be getting rid of them. Also, my Etsy is available for pre-order right now if you guys wanna get any of the stickers. I opened it up for my gallery specifically but if you guys wanna go and check out my Etsy, it's linked down below for you guys and I will be open for a few weeks, probably three at most. So get your stickers while you still can if you want them. I highly appreciate it and thank you guys so much for coming. If you are a RISD student, this gallery is open through this Friday so you can go and check it out. It's in the ISB building but if you're not, I hope you enjoyed my little virtual tour of my gallery. And again, it was just so nice meeting everyone. It was so much fun. I'm trying to think of if there's anything else that I wanted to say about it. It was just so great. So I am so, so happy. So yeah, I took a lot of cute pictures on Instagram. Like I said, so I'm gonna put a few up on the screen right now because it was so much fun. It just came out good. I was surprised. I'm very, very happy about that. But yes, yeah, so thank you so much everyone who came out, everyone who supported me through this journey and just all of you guys online. I am so incredibly thankful for the fan base that I have acquired over over the past four years on YouTube from going into college. You guys have really like seen me through everything. So it's been super duper fun. And it's just so like bittersweet having my senior show, you know, because it's kind of like a nice celebration of what's to come. And next week we will be making more things on this channel. So I want to thank you guys all so, so much. Ah! And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay high to take it out. If you want to see more pictures, they're on my Instagram. And let me know what you guys think down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.